In pop culture, most things entitled Beast are men with hearts of gold and a rough, hairy exterior. However, Beast is also the nickname for Trump's limousine. Although its exterior is fuzz-free, it's strong enough to have earned its moniker, and the outside is just the beginning. Here are 10 mind-blowing facts about President Trump's vehicle. Shifting gears for a moment, drive your finger on over to the subscribe button. Click it to make sure you stay up to date on the hub and don't get left in the dust. A whole new vehicle. Historically, the presidential vehicle has been created by Cadillac, although it's modified from the models available to civilians. Since most of us don't need a stockpile of weapons and hidden compartments in our vehicles, this makes sense. This vehicle, however, is unlike any former presidential vehicle. It's based on the Chevy Kodiak, a truck that hasn't been made since 2009. These vehicles are extremely rugged and were used from everything from dunk trucks to U-Hauls. While it has the raw diesel power of the Kodiak, design-wise, it's a sedan-type vehicle, despite its size. Some trim pieces are standard, such as the headlamp from the Escalade and taillights from the discontinued STS. The exposed chrome on the door handles and around the windows add a little beauty to this piece. Bulletproof. The fact that the president's vehicle is bulletproof definitely isn't mind-blowing on its own, since that seems like a standard feature in presidential vehicles. The incredible part is just how bulletproof it is. In fact, it's doubtful that there is a more heavily armored vehicle anywhere in the world. Its armored plating is so thick that the doors are nearly impossible to open from the outside. They weigh as much as the doors on a Boeing 757 aircraft. Made from a combination of dual hardness steel, aluminum, titanium, and ceramic, the beast would stand strong to even the most powerful projectiles. Even the windows are made up of five layers of glass and polycarbonate, each an entire inch thick. The front windshield can withstand armor-piercing bullets or a 44 Magnum. Chemical resistant. So while the beast may be more than able to stand up to gunfire, what about a chemical attack? After all, it takes more than just some extra steel to keep passengers safe in the event chemicals are used by an enemy. Even all the weapons stockpiled inside the car won't help you if you're up against dangerous gases. And if a shotgun and grill-mounted guns don't help you out of a situation, you know it's gotten pretty serious. The heavy doors are designed to create a perfect seal when closed. This means that offensive chemicals won't be able to seep inside to harm passengers. There is also an oxygen system stored in the trunk, just in case the attacks makes it difficult to breathe. Weaponry. If the best defense is a good offense, then Trump's vehicle is the safest car on the road. We all hate it when a fellow driver tailgates us. Instead of passively aggressively slowing down, Trump has the option of using tear gas cannons mounted on the rear bumper. Although the vehicle is always accompanied by armed Secret Service agents, it also comes with its own pump-action shotgun, just in case. There is also a gun mounted behind the front grille. Although we aren't privy to the details, it seems that the trunk is also chock full of weapons. So if you're the kind of person who likes to drive close to the bumper in front of you, why, don't be that person. This is one vehicle you definitely want to give it space. Diesel. What keeps an armored beast up and running? Diesel fuel, of course. The beast is believed to use a Duramax diesel engine, similar to the ones inside Chevy and GMC's most powerful, full-size, heavy-duty pickup trucks. Diesel engines are known for their durability, and this is especially important if you're designing a vehicle to withstand chemical attacks, gunfire, and more. In addition, diesel fuel is less volatile than other fuel types, which reduces the risk of explosions. It's also readily available all over the world, which makes it handy for traveling. And just in case someone takes aim at the fuel truck with enough force to cause even diesel to explode, they'd have to first penetrate the tank itself. Under its armored plating, it's filled with a special foam which prevents it from exploding, even under direct fire. Trunk full of blood. Some of us store a lot of literal junk in our trunks. Empty water bottles, spare pairs of shoes, and those canvas shopping bags we always forget to take in the store with us are frequently seen in our cars. We've heard of the belly of the beast, but it's the trunk of this beast that stores some items that could prove essential in case of an attack. We know that there are weapons and oxygen in the tank already, but what else would you need in an emergency? Here's a hint, you have some running through your veins right now. Trunk Full of Blood sounds like an awesome death metal album, but it's actually an accurate description of the beast. In case of an emergency blood transfusion, the trunk is chock full of blood in the president's preferred blood type. Specially Trained Drivers Having the most indestructible and powerful vehicle in the world doesn't do a lot of good if you don't have anybody to drive it. And you need more than a squeaky clean driving record to qualify for this position. To start out with, you need to be a member of the Secret Service. While details of their training is kept classified for obvious reasons, 
we do know some of the skills they need to learn, and they're straight out of a Bond movie. You've heard of defensive driving, but these agents learn offensive driving. They need to be able to master ramming other vehicles without putting their passengers or themselves at risk. Just in case they need to make a hasty retreat, they learn to reverse at high speeds and perfect the 180 degrees J-turn. The driver needs to learn to think of their vehicle as a weapon without resorting to stepping out of it and engaging in a gunfight. And because only the driver's side window is capable of opening, they have the most important job of all, placing the drive through order at Taco Bell. Tires. In action movies, it seems like tires are always the place bad guys aim for. And something as simple as a carefully placed spike trap can derail a normal vehicle, no matter how large. There's no thorn in the paw for this beast though. Its tires are gigantic and reinforced by the Kevlar, the same material used to make bulletproof vests. They're resistant to shredding and punctures and are what's known as run-flat tires, which means that you can continue to drive on them for a period of time, even if the tire goes flat. The steel rims are also reinforced to help the vehicle make it to safety in the event of an emergency. After all, it'd be rather embarrassing for the President of the United States to be seen waiting on the side of the road while someone changes his tire. It comes with an airplane. While we look for cars that come with luxury features such as Bluetooth, satellite radio, or extra cup holders, Trump's vehicle comes with a luxury few can afford, its own airplane. The plane is a high-wing, four-engine, T-tailed military transport aircraft known as a C-17 Globemaster. Manufactured by Boeing, this massive aircraft is large enough to accommodate a heavily armored suburban communications vehicle known as Roadrunner, a second limo, and of course, the beast itself. The Roadrunner is said to act as a mobile communications office and is linked to a military satellite. The plane is designed to transport massive quantities of cargo incredibly long distances, even in unpredictable weather conditions. Turbulence is no trouble for this behemoth of the skies. It's military grade and features four Pratt & Whitney PW2040 engines, each of which produces 40,440 pounds of thrust. Other accessories. As if all the other mind-blowing features we mentioned weren't enough, the Beast has a special set of unique accessories. These tactical items would be at home in any secret agent's toolkit. It's outfitted with a night vision camera, perfect for driving in any condition, or staking out your trash can to see if it's the raccoon or your neighbor's dog that keeps knocking them over. While we've already gone over most of the weapons inside the Beast, there is one we haven't mentioned. It's known as the nuclear football, and it's in the beast anytime Trump is. Carried by one of his military aides, this enables him to order a nuclear strike within 15 minutes. Most of us are probably picturing a big red button that says do not press, but it's actually equipment and authentication paperwork. The suspension has been upgraded from previous models and provides protection against roadside bombs and speed bumps. We're unfortunately not kidding about the speed bump thing, as it's actually been a major issue for past presidential vehicles. While President Trump may be used to being in the lap of luxury, we wonder how comfortable he is being encapsulated in this kind of security. It goes pretty far above and beyond what most people ever experience, and it's just one vehicle. If you had the chance to customize your own presidential vehicle, what would you add to it? And what would the name be? Thanks for coming along on the ride with the hub. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next time.